Hey everybody, it's Grayson from iMark Interactive. Uh, one of the big questions we've had with uh, uh, Gutenberg is how do you deal with nofollow links? Um, there are a few plugins now that work with the classic editor that basically give you a checkbox for nofollow. Uh, the problem is, is that none of these currently work with the new Gutenberg editor. Um, and, and we're not really big fans of uh, nofollow plugins because uh, when they break or they stop functioning, uh, we've seen uh, no follow links disappear. Um, we've seen some weird things, so we don't typically recommend these plugins anyway. Um, and, and we do have a, a, a link to a tutorial on how to add no follow links at WordPress, and that's in the current editor. So I, I figured we're going to develop um, a video for the Gutenberg editor here, and this is uh, really not too much different. But when you want to add no follow links in Gutenberg, there's no just a toggle switch. So you have to basically edit the HTML. And I'm going to show you exactly how to do that here. So we already kind of created a, um, a little sample post here that I'm going to edit. And we are on uh, WordPress 5.0 uh, beta, and we are using the Gutenberg editor. So. Um, I basically have the title and two paragraph blocks. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a link. And when you hover over text in a paragraph block, you hit the link button. And I'm just going to type in our URL. And you can hit this and hit apply, or you can hit this and see the open in new tab. So uh, typically, uh, we recommend opening external links in new tabs um, and and internal links in the same uh, tab or window. Um, it's really up to you how you want to deal with that, but we're going to apply this. And as you saw, there's no, th there's really no options. I mean, this is, this is really it. Um, you don't get any options over here when you hover over, you know, the link. There, there's really not much to it. So what you can do is in this, in the box, you hit the three vertical dots and then you hit edit as HTML. And you will see here is the basic link HTML. Um, and it also has, I mean, it has a lot more data than what we used to see before. Uh, so you will see that WordPress adds this right here. Now, this is kind of strange because no referrer was once removed from WordPress uh, because it was causing problems with affiliate links. Um, I don't know if this has been put back in, but basically um, your relation tag is where you put no follow in. So you can put it up front, and I'm actually going to delete the no refer. And now you have no follow, space, no opener. So you'll see it like that, how that, and that will space it. So what this is um, basically doing is you're putting the no follow in. You don't, don't add in another relation tag, okay? Just put it in the same relation tag that's there. So just add in no follow in the beginning and hit space. Um, I don't know about the no opener part. I, I or not op no opener, uh, no refer. I, I thought they took that out. Um, I wonder if they're going to take that out again. We'll kind of see. And then basically, you're ready to go. You come back and you hit um, edit visually and you're back. The one good thing about this um, is that you can just target the one paragraph that has the link in it. Before, you'd have to flip the entire editor and then you'd have to search for that link. Uh, you know, it could be all the way down at the bottom. And if you don't know code, you know, you, it's a little bit harder to look for. Here, you can just go, you know, you can just go to the, the one paragraph and um, and change it to edit as HTML. Make the change real quick, and then hit you know save draft or however you know publish or whatever you want to do. Um, but that's it. You know that's that's really the crux of adding no follow to links. So if you um, if you don't use a plugin or you uh, don't want to use a plugin, uh, this is a great way to do it. But you know as of right now, the popular plugins for no follow don't work on Gutenberg. So this is really something you should learn. Uh, if you guys have any questions about Gutenberg or uh, adding nofollow links, uh, let us know. Reach out at imarkinteractive.com or in the comments.